During a peace meeting among candidates of Fonyi Kantana district in the West Coast region on Sunday, Musa Amunyasi, the sitting parliamentarian for Fonyi Kantana, told his fellow contestants that the Kantana seat does not belong to him or his family, but to the people of Kantana. This came barely two weeks before the parliamentary elections, Mariama Cham reports. Musa Amunyasi, National Assembly member for Fonyi Kantana, is seeking re-election on the APRC ticket. In a press conference, Mr. Nyasi told the gathering that the councillor seat does not belong to him. Amun Nyasi adds that Fonya needs peace and unity to forge ahead from the recent issues. I know it will be surprising to the viewers and listeners that the incumbent is sharing the same platform with young people who are aspiring for the seat on which he is sitting. But I want to make it clear, I have always been emphasizing that the seat I am sitting on, it's not my personal seat. It's not Nyasekunda's seat. It's not Jinia's seat. It's the seat of the people of Fonyi Kansala. They have the mandate to elect who to sit on that seat. Whether they elected or not, that depends on the people of Kansala. But the spirit... The spirit should be we are not enemies we are not enemies we are all out to sell our developmental agenda how we are going to better represent our people the tension between the mfdc rebels and the senegalese army around gambia's border belt with southern senegal led to the displacement of thousands of people within Fonyi. amun has been taking the lead with security forces in calming the people of Fonyi since tension erupted in the region we have seen aspiring candidates who are going out beating their chests as if they are above the government. They can make it happen. Any day they assume uh, the, the seat of being a representative of the people. But that is a misleading information. That impression is wrong. It's unfounded. Even whereas you are a National Assembly member from the ruling party, you cannot remote control what the government will do. But what you do is you have to be diplomatic in your approach. You have to engage constructively and then criticize when the need is there to criticize. Constructive criticisms. Because the government will know that there is somebody who is serving as a watchdog on us. But if you want to be confrontational, you end up being a loser and there is no way you can win. So let us be sincere and genuine when we are canvassing for votes. The city Nam urged his comrades not to be misled by individuals or groups. Don't ever be deceived by anyone, be it a follower or followers. Be guided by your consent and let you speak your mind freely and openly. When you go to bed, you sleep until you snore. But if you allow people to dictate how you go about your politicking, at the end of the day, they are going to be the same people who will stand aside and start pointing fingers at you. We all have a collective responsibility in the maintenance of security in this country, particularly for our region. Together, we stand. Divided, we fall. Musa Amunyasi is among seven candidates contesting for the Fonyi Councillor seat in the forthcoming parliamentary elections slated for April 9th. Reporting for iAfrica News, I am Mariamacham.